What's up, YouTube? It's your boy Connor Garrity coming at you. New video right now. Before I get into the video, I want to pre do, do this as a little premise and a little shout out to Mr. Nike SB6. One of, I'm going to call him my shoe idol. That guy is an absolute monster. He's always showing me love on Instagram, always showing me love uh, in the comments and likes. Guy is a really good guy. I'm going to put his channel in the description. And he is one of those guys that when I'm looking for a new sneaker, an SB, an older SB, and I want to look and see and get all the details about it, that's the channel I go to. When I want a discussion video, because he does some really good discussion videos, he's one of those guys that always puts out great discussion videos. He's always keeping it real. He's always keeping it just... He's always keeping his channel up to date he's always doing new content he, he's he is my one of my shoe idols if not the shoe idol so mr nike sb6 i hope you see this i'm gonna send this to you in a message and i just want to say again thank you so much for the love you've shown me thank you so much for inspiring me to make these videos man thank you thank you thank you and this video is coming off of your video man about the hunt for sneakers um, he posted a video today talking about how his drive to get these sneakers and to buy sneakers and the reason he loves sneakers is that hunt. He loves the hunt for getting a sneaker. And I absolutely agree. And I think that is, I didn't mention this in my sne other video, the tips for sneakerheads to get into it. This is the main thing I think that separates the shoe enthusiast from the guy who can truly call himself a sneakerhead a person who just loves and lives in breeze sneakers because it's that hunt it's that want it's that drive to get that new sneaker to do what you got to do to get that new sneaker and that doesn't mean putting your family aside and that doesn't mean spending money that you don't have on a sneaker that means striving and doing everything that's right for your family and doing everything I don't know kosher to support your family Mr. XSB6 I want to say this right now I haven't said it to you congratulations on your daughter man congratulations that kid your kids man have these illest sneaker game illest sneaker game his kids have the illest sneaker game check out his Instagram illest sneaker game but it's that drive and that want to get new sneakers and I understand that because that's what really, I think that's what makes you a sneaker person again. I know I'm repeating myself a little bit, but it's it's just that passion that you have, that you want this sneaker and you're going to work hard to get this sneaker. You're going to be patient and you're going to get this sneaker at the right price. You're not going to overspend. You're not going to jeopardize your family or do something like that. You're going to wait for the right price. It's that hunt to get the sneaker at A, the right price, B, the right time. And it's all those hours that you spend looking for and trying to get that sneaker and searching on eBay and searching on Soul Collector and searching on Craigslist and searching all these sites and contacting people and hitting up your connect. Excuse me. And just looking and bargaining. It's... It's that thing that drives you inside. And sometimes it drives you mad looking for a sneaker and you think you might get it. And at the last second you're unable to get it because it goes out of your range and you're not going to overpay for it. And you have your boundaries. It's just that, ugh, it's that it feeling inside of you. If you watch Top Gear, it's the fizz, as James May would say. It's just that fizz. Like... Uh, throwing up my bed right now because I've got some sneakers under there. Like these. My Adidas Top 10 2000s that I just got. I could have bought these for... I was seeing them online at some places. And they're hard to find online. There aren't a ton. I was seeing them at like $150 with like $25 shipping. And I wasn't going to pay that. I waited. I waited. I waited. I was hoping maybe I'll see these one day. Price go, Price is down on these. Maybe one day. And they don't have a ton of them up for listings. Blah, blah, blah. Waiting, just waiting, just waiting. And then they come out. And then I go to the store and I see them. 80 bucks. Bam. Got them. Um, let's see. 
Ugh. Pull on an SB. Nike Dunk High Krampus right here. Kept looking, kept looking, kept looking, kept looking. Looked for about... Kept looking for a little while and eventually found them for 15 bucks over retail which with free shipping which to me that means nothing that's a great deal it's that strive and that want and that just passion for them that makes you want you know you want that one sneaker there's those sneakers that you just want and you have to have and you just hunt and you look every day for that one sneaker and I have that one sneaker right now I have that one sneaker and if I find it at the right price I will buy it in a heartbeat I will I am still looking for it it is the Nike Dunk High Shima Shima 3's I, I and for him he talks about in the video how you know he just bought the Metacom 4's which are amazing I love all white I was rocking all white today, man. I was I was flossing. I had people. I had the white snapback with the white tee and the white shorts, and I had on some some flip flops. And I had these text people like, "What in the hell is that boy wearing?" <laughs> but anyway, it's just that hunt again. I can't describe it. It's hard to describe. But and let me just pull this out. Sorry for getting out of the screen for a second. These right here. The shoes I just picked up today. Reebok questions. I've been looking for this shoe since it dropped, I think. I've been looking for it at the right price. And it was just this week on Monday that I found them at the right price and bought them. I love this sneaker. This is probably my favorite sneaker of all time it just means so much to me I had to get it but I wasn't gonna overspend you know I see these going from some people for like 200 something bucks oh that leather smells so good it smells like real leather people but I waited I waited I was patient you know, finally I found them online. I found them at the price at a price that I was comfortable with. You know what? I couldn't even be happier, man. I couldn't be happier. I'm so happy I got these. And I think these are exactly what he's talking about. You know, these aren't SBs, but these are something that I think Mr. Nike SB, this is what I think he was trying to get at. When you have that sneaker that you want, and you do your damnedest, and you work at it, and you work on people... You look for them, and you do what you got to do to get your sneakers without sacrificing, you know, things that are necessary for your family or sacrificing your life or anything like that. And so I just want to say, again, Mr. Nike SB6, you are, you are the man. He is the man. Again, check out his channel after this. But I just want to talk about my opinion on his video, The Hunt for Sneakers, because it's something when I watched today it really did speak to me. It really spoke to me because that's why I, I've i had people say, why do you like sneakers so much? And it's because I have that passion. I think they're art. And it's like chasing down a painting. It really is to me. I'm looking for that one painting. I'm looking for that one thing that's going to satisfy my needs. That thing that just makes you, that drives you, and that you'll wake up early for, and that you'll stay up till 2 o'clock in the damn morning to bid on them. It's that thing that you love, and that it's just that blind passion that you have. Can't really explain it. It's undefinable, but you know in your heart of hearts, you just have that passion, and you have that love. And that's what he was talking about, I think. So again, Mr. Nike SB6, thank you so much for the love you've shown me. Much love to you. And shout out to you, my man. Shout out to you. And at that, thank you all for watching. This has been Connor Garrity at the G Money 041 channel. Check out my other videos. Like, comment, subscribe, all that good business. Again, shout out Mr. Nike SB6. Much love. And with that, I gotta hit everybody with a peace.